And still get amazed. Watch Logan Couture right here. <laughs> he sees a forward what? Well, as I said, a forehand deep is tougher than a backhand. You better. Right there. Holy Nice. It's a settle down there. Fakes the backhander, goes to the floor. Natsuk in on goal. Oh. And he does. Hey everybody and welcome to the video. Today is the second video on stick handling and who better to emulate and talk about than Pavel Datsuk and Patrick King. In the last video we talked about using our wrists and the proper technique. In this video we're going to talk about transferring weight. It's really important to transfer your weight. If you can't transfer your weight properly people won't go for it. And a lot of times at minor hockey drills I see kids they're coming into stick handling drills and they're only using their wrist they're not even committing to an actual deke fake left go right fake right go left those are old skills that we used to in the old days we used to play a lot of shinny um, kids they don't get that opportunity anymore uh, shinny those were important opportunities for us we got to play against other people and make lots of moves and that's a lost art in today's game you need to be able to teach it and focus on transferring your weight when you're moving and when you're stick handling. That's how you get some of these moves like Pavel Datsuk. Basically, when the puck went to the to Mike, when he, when he, my goodness. And of course, Patrick Kane. And what we see here is guys going left to right, right to left, using that lateral power. That's really important to have that strength in your legs, making sure that you can really push off and transfer that weight so that in the speed of the game, it's not a problem for you to go right to left. Now, as you can see, this guy is using too much arms, but if you have four pucks, this is a good circuit for the kids to go through. Stick handling through the pucks, doing a tight turn at the blue line, always to the boards. This guy did it wrong. And then making a move, fake left, go right, taking a shot on the goalie. Okay, this guy comes in. Now we can do a flip over the stick if the kids are old enough to be able to do that. Or a toe drag, just like this guy did here. These kind of skills are the things that we can progress and link together so that the kids actually work on these things. Keeping in mind that we really want them to focus on transferring their weight, their weight when they're doing the moves. And as always, it's really important for these kids to go full speed. Always pushing themselves to the limits, making sure that they're trying to fail as much as possible. Because as coaches, if we're not pushing them to fail, then they probably won't and they'll take the easiest route out. Thanks for watching the video today. The next, we do have one more stick handling video coming, so watch for it. Uh, as always, like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you know when the next videos are coming. Until next time, take care.